For the first time, intelligent hearing aids controlled by smartphones are available on the NHS. It's part of a Europe-wide trial involving three London hospitals. The hope is that it could help reduce the risk of noise-induced hearing loss and slow down the early stages of dementia. Helen Drew has the details. Here at Guy's and St Thomas's, there's a big hearing aid trial taking place. Now, hearing aids aren't new, and in fact there are some apps that can control them, but never before has the combination of the two been available on the NHS as part of this trial. Now, as well as being able to control the volume of the hearing aid using the app, it will alert you if it thinks you're somewhere too noisy. So we've got the controls here, yeah. and what we've got here is the left and right, so we can adjust the volume on the hearing aids. And we have the four different programs, so I can I'd switch between the different programs which are suitable for different environments. So we might be talking quietly as we are now, or we might be out in the street, or at a concert, uh, whatever, and the different programs suit different environments. It's particularly valuable in a noisy city like London. The hearing aids will detect noise in the environment. I mean, we all live in London, we know it's a noisy city and when they're exposed to a hazardous level of noise that might damage their hearing, the app alerts them with a little ping um, and it prompts them to take a hearing test which they can do through the hearing aid and then they can see whether their hearing's changed and they can take measures to get themselves out of that, that noisy place. The hope is the trial can also help slow the early stages of dementia. What we think is that the reason for this is that people are not getting enough stimulation in their environment because they can't hear very well. So they're not having conversations, they're not getting the interaction with the community that keeps your brain active and, uh, and engaged and keeps dementia at bay. So we think that if you treat hearing loss with hearing aids at an early enough stage, that will reduce the risk of getting dementia. It's part of a big trial happening across Europe and it's being funded by the EU. The app was written in Greece and several other European countries are also involved. Back here in London, City University is taking part and then it's here at Guy's and St Thomas's as well as at UCL where they're recruiting people to be involved.